love affair is at times unstoppable. You know you're in love when you cannot fall asleep because reality is finally better than dreams. Now, as you're laying alone in the bed, looking at your favorite painting, saying to yourself, would I give up my favorite art for a love affair in paradise? Hear the recipe of this passion exchange. I would give up my favorite painting for the opportunity to spend a life in a paradise and find the love of my life. And I said yes. Love in paradise, is that the question? And my answer was absolutely fucking yes. Love is way more important to me than art. I was just asked by this kind gentleman um, if I was willing to give up my favorite painting among the some that I have for a week in paradise. And the answer is no. And after thinking very deeply and pondering upon this question, my answer is yes, because I don't own my favorite painting in the first place. I don't think anybody ever owns a painting. Take that to your grave and make love in paradise. If I give up my best painting for a romance in paradise, well, I'm married and I have already my romance, but romance in paradise, I think I will give it up. I was asked if I would give up my favorite painting in my collection for a love affair in Paris. And my answer was, most likely, <laughs> if it was a long-term love affair with the love of my life. I would give up my favorite painting for a love affair in paradise. And I say, no. It actually took me some time because the connection you have to your favorite art piece is like none you can explain. It is a sacred connection you feel with art and the artist and the emotion that it made you feel the first time you saw it. But to experience something in life that's worth telling about or worth painting about or worth sharing a story over, that's what art represents. And I think if you had the option to let go of your main piece of art for an experience like that, it's what an artist would dream of doing. So I would let it go, of course and experience life to the fullest, and then paint something amazing right after. So the question was, would I trade in a piece of art from an artist that I admired for a romantic experience with anyone I choose in paradise? And the answer is I would choose the experience because our generation is fueled by experience. And what we own and what we purchase does not belong to us. It belongs to the artist that created it. We're just on a temporary lease until our time is up. So I choose the experience over and over and over again. I was asked if I would give up my favorite painting if I could have a love affair in paradise. Well, why not? I was asked if I would give up my favorite piece of art to spend time in paradise, and I think I would because uh, I think experiences are what connect us to the world around us. What's up, man? It's your boy Swag Splash. Got the best out killing that swag like mosquitoes the West now. I was asked, would I give up my favorite painting for a lavish life in an island? And I sure would. My name is Sarah, and I was asked the question, if I would give up my favorite piece of art for a love affair in paradise, would I? And my answer is yes, because a love affair is a one of a lifetime situation. Even though art, my art here is very important to me, love is something that is something that just makes it is life love is life so yes I would choose a love affair over my favorite piece of art no if I uh, would swap my favorite piece of art for love and li a life in paradise well I'd rather have both and I'd probably put it on this wall right here and then have the love affair just down here and I would say no, I would not give up my favorite piece of art to have a love affair in paradise. Would I give up my favorite painting for a love affair in paradise? And I said, yes. 
And I said no. Hi, yes, I absolutely would give up my favorite painting for a beautiful, luxurious trip in paradise. I would only give up my favorite painting if the love affair lasted the rest of my life. If it was temporary, then I would keep the painting because I would have that forever. Yes, I would definitely give up my favorite painting for Romance in Paradise, but then who wouldn't? And would I give up my favorite painting for Unrevolate Romance in Paradise? And my answer is absolutely. I just came from Paradise. I just spent two weeks in Samoa. So I know from Paradise and I can always paint another other favorite painting forever and the answer is no because I don't believe that paradise is somewhere else I believe that paradise is in the work that we do and my favorite pieces of art are paradise for me I give out my favorite art piece for a moment in paradise my answer was yes I definitely would for a romance in paradise if I would give up my favorite piece of art for romance in paradise and my response absolutely deep pockets Aww. I was asked the question that I would be that I would give up my favorite piece of art for eternal paradise and I would say I would would I give up my favorite painting or piece of art for romance in Paris and I would would you I would definitely give up